In this problem, a uniform rod of weight 12 newtons and length 6 meters hangs in equilibrium in a horizontal position. It is held in position by two light vertical cables attached at A and B as shown. Find the tension of the cable at A and the tension of the cable at B. OK, so on this diagram, I'm going to add in the forces that are working here. So at point A, we've got this string, OK, uh, the vertical cable. And so there's going to be tension in that cable, and I'm going to call that TA. Particle B, no, sorry, uh, point B, this will also have tension in the cable. I'm going to call that tension B. Now, we know that the uniform rod has weight 12 newtons. The whole stretch of the rod is 6 metres. So that must mean that the weight must work um, somewhere there, okay, at the centre of mass, uh, 12 newtons, and this is one metre away from B, okay? Right, so, in order to find the tension of the cable at A, if I take moments about particle B, sorry, point B, I keep saying particle, point B, OK, then that means I don't have to worry about the tension at B. So if I take moments about point B, we're in equilibrium, so it's got to be zero. So what have I got? Well, I've got the 12 newtons, which was working anti-clockwise. So that's positive. So I've got 12 lots of one metre away. And then I've got TA, which is working clockwise round. So take away TA times, and I am three metres away from that point, and so that's got to be zero. So, if I add the three lots of TA to both sides, divide both sides by three, 12 divided by three is four. So that must mean that the tension at A is four newtons. Now, at this point, I could, to find the tension of the cable at B, take moments about A, in a very like, uh, similar way, or I can find the resultant force. So, well, the resultant force is zero, but then using that, I can find TB. So I'm going to do that. So if I resolve taking upwards as positive, I've got TA, which is the 4 newtons. I've got 12 newtons of working against us. I've got TB working upwards, and that's got to be equal to zero. 4 take 12 is minus 8. Add, that to, add 8 to both sides, and so TB is 8 newtons. OK, so that's how we can find the tension in the cable at A and the tension of the cable at B.